How is it possible that in a little over 10 years of film work, Heath Ledger became one of the greatest actors of all time? Ledger belonged to a rare breed of actors, one of those actors that was simply likable in any role, whether it be the mysterious high school bad boy or a psychotic clown terrorizing a city, you couldn't help but like his characters. When Ledger was on screen, he oozed charm and he always won us over. Trust in me when I say, oh pretty baby, don't bring me down a In his early roles, Ledger took advantage of his charm and good looks, playing a high school heartthrob, a soldier, and a peasant turned knight in shining armor. Ledger soon began to not only take on more serious roles, but he also began to demonstrate himself as a skilled chameleon. I think it often goes overlooked since he received so much praise for disappearing into the role of the Joker, but The Dark Knight was not Ledger's first transformative performance. Look at these four clips back to back. It's hard to believe that the same person is playing all four parts. Where you been, huh? Yeah. Why, you just forget about practice or what? Then why don't you... Why don't you just let me be, huh? You tell me I've changed as if that's all there is to say. You know, in this completely different voice than the one you had 10 minutes ago. <laughs> I don't, don't want to kill you. And speaking of the Dark Knight, if you're like me and grew up in the 90s, the Dark Knight was likely a pretty big milestone regarding your love for cinema. It was literally our generation's Star Wars or E.T. Part of the reason that this movie registered with me so deeply was due to Ledger's hypnotic performance as the Joker. Half. <laughs> You're crazy. I'm not. No, I'm not. I remember being a kid sitting in the theater on opening night, simply mesmerized by what Ledger was doing. That unmistakable feeling that you were witnessing something special, and the eeriness that came along with knowing that this person was gone from the world, but was alive and larger than life right in front of me, transcending reality and cinema. Hi. Everyone knew that this performance would go down in history as one of the greats. We were right. And the Oscar goes to Heath Ledger in The Dark Knight. It's easy to pigeonhole Ledger as the Joker because it is without a doubt his crowning performance. But an equally astonishing performance is the one that he gives in Brokeback Mountain. Playing a closeted cowboy, Ledger ditched his natural Australian accent for muddy Western mumbles. That's how come uh, me to end up here. He forced us to agonize with him and feel every painstaking breath that he took. We feel his struggle and his turmoil, but we also feel his love. This performance needs no validation, but let's hear what one of the other greatest actors of all time had to say about it. And, and then, of course, in Brokeback Mountain, he was unique, he was perfect. Um, and that, that scene in the trailer at the end of the film is as moving as anything that I think I've ever seen. In Brokeback Mountain, Ledger turned in what would be, in the case of any other actor, a legacy-defining performance. But not for Heath. He had two of these performances in just a fraction of the time. The way we cherish and idolize Ledger, it feels like he lived out one of the greatest careers in cinema. But the sad thing is, he was just getting started.